Good morning, everybody. This is Bryson Muir, the little boy who was allegedly kidnapped by the cult. I was perusing some videos to try to understand a little bit about what is going on with the cult and what happened to Bryson. The young man with the ginger hair is commenting on Elder Kabir and Pastor Dow, but he really doesn't say a whole bunch about Pastor Dow. It's very bootlicking in nature towards Kabir. This guy says this is some good slavery. I, I couldn't make this shit up if I tried. The, there's another video where Kabir says, hey, look, look at me, look at me, everybody. I can leave the cult. I can leave the cult any anytime I want. I can just drive away. If you read the messages on the video, it is traveling with the approval of Pastor Dow. He's not escaping anything. He's just leaving the physical property that the cult is on. He's very much traveling with the approval of the pastor. In this post, there is probably not an official follower, but someone who's been on the fringes of the organization for quite a while. And he says he's been following PD, that's Pastor Dow, since before you, that's that's KGB, the clown that got tased in court for failing to sign a paper. He says, I, you know, hey, I like him. I, I liked what he stood for. He must mean like having a bunch of wives and having $300 a week for liquor. That's literally the only draw that I could see. I thought about joining many times over the years. I liked what PD stood for. That said, I'm concerned about the boy. He reminds me of my son, and I hate knowing he endured the assault prior to his disappearance. KGB says, be at peace. Our brother is safe and sound in the name of Yah. Atomic Outcast. That's me. That's my art. That's my art page. My um, cold cases and whatnot pages, Ghost and Graveyard. Have you seen this personally, or do you mean in the divine sense? He says, I know the young man's creator. Is your love for the young man greater than his father? I think he means, do I love Bryson more than his father does? It's not quite, I don't think it, when I read it out loud, it didn't quite make sense, but I think that's what it means. Anyway, I said, uh, uh, very much. Very much, obviously, because it broke my heart to see him covered in bruises. Physically beating a child serves no positive purpose. And that is all I know about the Bryson Muir story this morning.